Okay, we're starting in the armory before our English speaking tour starts. I think we all recognize who that is. I came to the side so I was out of the way. So you all could come in. But. St. John? Okay, that was St. John we just saw. Beth, you want to be my narrator and explain what things are? Sure. As we go, where would you like to start? This is St. John of Nepomuk, N-E-P-O-M-U-K. Okay, I'm getting better. Silver, partly gold-plated wood base by Franz Christoph. Something else I can't pronounce. 1752. Okay. And then just to the right. Scusa. Portion of belongings of Prince Elector Philip Carl Zu Eltz. We've got a number one. Oh. Would be a sundial from 1735. Right here. Number two would be Prince Elector Philip Carl miniature around 1740. Okay. And he was ugly. Three would be powder horn. Straight below it. Okay. Four would be the walking stick with a watch, French, around 1740. Oh, here. Yes. Does it look phallic to anyone? Nah. <laughs> Five would be cupping glass with a case. Okay. Would be German. Right here. Okay. <clears throat> Six. Six are rings with interchangeable stones. That's cool. They are from 1730. That's very cool. I really like that. Good idea. Mm -hmm. Seven would be a German cutlery set from around 1740. I like the prongs. Oh, there we go. And eight would be. What are the handles made out of? Is that ivory? Okay. Eight would be a bowl with a lid. Silver and gold plated by Johann Erhond. Okay. Lynn the second. Okay. Oh, and there's the walking stick. I missed it. Nice window. Uh, first one would be travel altars. Okay. Teeny tiny Um, two would be a missile from Mans. Mans. I'm not sure what that is. Where's the S-A-L? Where's the S-A-L? Oh, my S-S-A-L is right here. Oh, I'm Oh, a missile. What's that? Um, it's a uh, Bible that she used for the church. Okay. Three would be a Miss, chalice. Miss Book. Made of silver. <gasps> it's a holy grail! Plated in enamel in its carrying case. Very cool. Oh, very nice. I've already got one. <laughs> Is that another one? I'm sorry, I'm trying to hit you with that. The belongings of Provost Hugo Franz Zell Elt. Um, one is a shield shaped hood from a cape. Cool, so that was on someone's cape? Yep, from 1770. Badass. That's really Provost interesting. Provost Hugo Franz miniature would be number two. Three would be the implements for the Eucharist. U Eucharist? There you go. Eucharist? Yeah, I was right. Never right. Bad. Silver it's not and gold plated. This is what they, what they give communion with. Okay. Yes. Very good. Thanks, Matt. I like you all talking. <laughs> Seriously. Cabinet five would be. Number one? Flintlock hunting carbine. Explain. What, what is says. that? It just tells you made it around 1800. Okay. Cross for hunting. Oh, uh huh. Two would be a powder horn. I'm guessing that would be more like snuff. This has got to be the wrong case. I think this. We're in case six. Ah. We're in case five. Ah. Case five. Okay. We'll just skip because we're here. Sorry. So case the first six. one here. Number one. Number mm -hmm. one. Got it. Pocket watch in the form of a pectoral. Notice the around 1585. This was a gift from Pope Sextus V, S I X T U S, to Prince Elector Johann Jacob Zu Eltz. Okay. Two would be a figure clock. 
Very cool. Three would be a table clock. Four is yet another table clock. It's down here. I'm getting detail. Okay. You're fine. And five with the lion would be the ornamental clock from around 1670. And we missed the case with all the guns and stuff. I don't really care that much about the guns, so you can gloss over them. There. Yeah. But, neat. On top. Is that a family tree? Yep. Why is the middle cut out? I don't know. Oh, it's the three main branches that started, I would believe. Since it's the, it's the base. So you have the... Anna, Elisa Bay branch, and then you have the Johann Jacob Zilts, and then you have the Johann Anton tree. But very cool because it's got the castle in the background, yeah. somebody sitting here at the base with the suit of armor and a shield. would be Johann Jacob Zilts. This is super cool. With all their shields. Okay, sorry about going so fast. Okay, Beth. Zeben? Okay, this is for you, Laura. The porcelain manufacturer in Hoist was founded in 1746 as a fiancé manufacturer. The porcelain manufacturer was added in 1750, initially a private trading company under the auspices of the Mains chapter. It was converted into a public limited company in 1766 by the elector of Mainz. The Counts Hugo Franz Karl and Eslem Casimir Zuelt were among the founding shareholders. We've got a tableware set with a floral pattern and a red notched edge around 1770. Coffee and tea set, medallion pattern, 1755. Mocha cups will be the little teeny ones. Uh -huh. Tableware set and mocha cups and a floral pattern. The rest of them are pretty much already said. Justin's mom will love these. Look how beautiful. But you have a floral pattern and a garland pattern. And the garland is the ones on the ends. On the ends. Okay. But the little cups are going to be chocolate. So these are the little cups she was just talking about. The milk tossing chocolate cups. Okay. Oh. Here's some glassware. This is the coats of arms of Prince Elector Philip Carl and of the Provost Hugo Franz. The bottom would be the coat of arms of other Prince Electors. So, for example, we've got the lion, like we saw outside, with mm -hmm. the two dragon looking things in the crown. Mm -hmm. All the front ones look the same. The yeah. back ones look different. Yeah. I have a got four corners and four. a scepter and a uh, sword on either side. And then down at the bottom was of other other dukedoms. Yeah. Well, no, we're in the same dukedom. Okay. It would be. I like this painted one. Other prince electors. Okay, Noinsis or Noin. This will be the Archduke Johann of Austria, brother of Emperor Franz, grandson of Empress Maria Theresa, great 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 grandfather of the present owner, and that would be number one. Which the is picture hanging in the center. Gotcha. 
Two would be the objects of art. We've got a boxwood. Oh, up here. A horn. Right here.